The bridge was completed in March this year to make life easier for the poverty-stricken community. It's just over five meters long and three meters wide. Residents say the bridge started showing cracks a few days after it was officially handed over. It's believed only bricks and cement were used as building materials for the bridge. It is three million, um, three thousand two hundred and eighty-five rand, which has been spent in this bridge. On this bridge, um, I've been passing here time and again when they were while they were constructing this bridge. They did not even use any steel. There is no steel that has been used. Um, the cement level of the cement, or the thickness of the cement, is just um, five centimeter thick which is not fit for, for the bridge. Even at your place or at your home, you cannot do such a uh, amount of, uh, of the cement. And we were expecting them to construct a, a very beautiful bridge because the amount is suitable to, 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 to use uh, in order to, to construct a very usable bridge and a big bridge. But this one is a very poor bridge. Speaking on behalf of residents, a local civic organization is dubbed the bridge a death trap and a waste of tech Pays money. We are very concerned with this. Clearly, this is a waste of money. They've almost done nothing here. We dare them to prove that the bridge is worth three million rand. Although the SABC News was shown what the DA alleges to be the project standard document, the Makado municipality has refuted that 3 million hands were spent on the project. Mayor Samuel Miai says only 200,000 rand was allocated for the construction of the bridge. Rutendo Bobori, SABC News, Sendeza Village.